Let's take a look at how to embed a gadget into a Google site. In this case, it happens to be a website counter, as you can see in the lower left of this site. Someone asked me to put this together. So let's take a look and see how that was created. And you can take a look also to see how embedding takes place. So let's go behind the scenes and take a look at this little text block here. We'll click on Edit Sidebar. And here is our text box that we created. We can add sidebar items to our navigation area by clicking on this. We created a text box. So we'll go to Edit. You can give a name to the text box. And you can see you've got your editing tools just like you would with any Google page. And this works the same on a Google page. So let's take a look at the process. Well, here's the counter right here, as you can see. And here's some text. And here is a website that I got this counter from. There's a lot of counters out there in the web. I'll take you to this particular one, but you can find your own if you'd like. And if we want to see how that's done, let's go ahead and click on the HTML tool button. And this is where you'll have an opportunity to copy and paste the embedding code of the gadget you want to put on your Google site. Let me go ahead and say update on that, and let's go see how we did that. We'll say OK and return to our site. That's OK. Here's the site that I had used, and there are a lot of different counters that you can pick from and a lot of different websites out there. They're free to use. You just have to uh, answer a few questions, create an account, and they'll give you the embedding code. So let's take a look at the embed code. Here's one I've already created, the counter that you can see. It says get HTML code. And you have to tell it what site it's going to. I'm going to go to HTML code button right over here just to show you. And there's the code. You simply have to copy that code, return back to our site, and we're going to go into that counter, I guess, and we'll take a look at that. Edit sidebar, edit text, and remember to change this, we need to go to our HTML, and there is the place where we can simply highlight and copy paste that embedded code. Say update. Say OK. Be sure to save changes and return to your site. Now, anything that has an embedding code, like a video or a gadget, should work on Google Sites. I found a few that did not, but you can test this as you start to embed things. Well, that's how to embed a gadget in a Google site or page.